Callus family, it's finally here. Bodybuilding with Calisthenics, I'm finally starting my bulk. Today is July 4th, so happy 4th of July to all you Americans out there. Now it's time to do the weigh-in. So I just went and set up the scale. And a lot of you guys already know how much I weigh from the previous two videos, but I'm going to do it again for the sake of bodybuilding with Calisthenics. So let's check my weight right now. It's going to be 147 point, 149 point 6, hold on, I don't know if it's weighing me differently because I ate before I went to sleep or something, you know what I'll try to do then, before I go to sleep, I won't eat anything after 12, just so I can try to make sure the, the weight is accurate, because right now it's weighing me in at... 149.6 pounds Whatever 147, 149 We already know the goal is to reach 170 anyway By the way guys, I just woke up Like literally, when I woke up I just went and turned on the camera and I started recording So that's why I don't have so much energy right now But after I have my My first meal and get my workout in Yo, I'm gonna turn up I'm gonna turn the hell up, bruh By the way, look Look at young strength over size Look at that five head though. You see that lineup? <laughs> but the hair was looking fresh though. That lineup was looking fresh though. I just have a big ass head. Jeez, I got a lot of emails. But hey, some subscribers. Wait, yo, how many how many subscribers does SOS have now? We are so close, guys. So close. Just six more. Tell your friends and family to subscribe and hurry up so we can get up to six thousand of us. By the way. I have more views than that, trust me. Let me show you. This is my real number of views. I have 526,000, not 517. Y'all do better than that, man. Y'all watch my videos way more than what YouTube is trying to say. Trying to lie on a ninja. Hey, someone just subscribed. Thank you to... Mah Mahatar Hassan. You know what's funny? Recently... I've been getting a lot of Indians watching my channel. Like it told me, it said a lot. Of, it basically said a lot of Indians have been viewing your video recently, which is pretty sick. So shout out to India. Okay, guys, it's time to do the monthly measurements of my chest, arm, and thighs. I'm gonna make sure I put this around the thickest part of my arm. So let's try to get this around here. And there it is, guys. 14 inches, and yep, it's measured pretty. Pretty accurately. So you can't measure it. You can't measure it down below here. You gotta measure it around here, the thickest part of your arm, and 14 inches. Now getting my chest, it won't be the most accurate thing since it's like not easy to measure your chest. But I'll try to get as high as possible for the thickest part of my chest. Get it around there. Go around. I know it's not so accurate, but we'll just work with this. 37, 37 inches. And of course you guys wanna see my sexy ass, skinny ass legs. So let me try to get this around. I'm gonna measure at this birthmark because it's an easy landmark for me to always measure at to see the growth. So we'll just go around right here at the birthmark. What is that? 22 inches guys. Do you guys see that? Let me zoom in. Let me zoom in. Hopefully there's no see no dick print. 22 inches guys. 22. Damn, my chest is wider than my leg. Well, that's true. Yeah. So some of you guys can already guess what I'm going to be having. Come on guys. It's the staple meal to have when it comes to bodybuilding. Chicken and rice. Chicken and rice. Everybody loves some chicken and rice. Yes, I have some leftover chicken and rice. I'm going to eat all of this as my pre-workout. Well, you know what? It's not really something I have for pre-workout, but I have no choice. There's not much else to eat in this house right now. I'm, I may have to go out and do some grocery. I might have some egg. I'm going to have to buy some bread. I'm going to buy some potatoes. Yeah, I, I need to get some food still if I really want to do this bulk because, geez, I can't I can't bulk off of like 500 calories. Oh, I really want to get that whey protein too. And you know what? I'm going to have me a, two cups actually. This is actually two cups of lemonade, so it's about 260 calories for those of you guys who are wondering. 
and it's just basically full of sugar and full of carbs. But whatever, I'm trying to get the calories in. So I'm about to go enjoy this meal. About 400 calories right there, 400. 400, just over 400. 260 calories. I think that's a pretty good pre-workout if you ask me. Okay guys, so whoever believes that calisthenics and bodybuilding do not go together, you are absolutely wrong. Jeez, I even had a hard time with this workout and I do calisthenics. Now of course the weighted vest is really what increased the intensity, it wasn't something I was used to. I really thought I was going to crank out all of these dips like nothing with the weighted vest. Well obviously not like nothing. But damn, I was struggling, like I looked like a noob. The way I'm looking in this video right here, that's how I looked when I first started calisthenics without any weight, right? For those of you guys asking why there's a shirt on the ground, it's because the ground was really hot. It was burning up my hands, so I put my shirt on the ground, and I just like taking my shirt off when I'm exercising. Oh, by the way, I really want to make this clear. You're going to see me use the weighted vest as external weight. But the thing about bodybuilding with calisthenics is that I'm doing it outside and not in the gym. And I'm using mostly calisthenics to build my muscle. Of course, I'm using my weighted vest to increase the intensity or to just achieve that progressive overload. And another reason why I'm using calisthenics to bulk is because not only do I just hate working out in the gym. I just hate using dumbbells and barbells. It isn't really my thing. I find it really boring, but again, to each his own. You guys may enjoy it. I don't really enjoy it. I really like it working out outside. Not to mention, I get a workout for free right outside of my house. So I don't have to travel anywhere, pay no bus fare, blah, blah, blah. But while I'm doing calisthenics and bulking, I get to get better at calisthenics. I can increase my push-ups, increase my pull-ups, and everything while doing calisthenics and bulking at the same time. So it's like hitting two birds at one stone. By the way, I'm looking so ripped here. I love how my chest looks. And for those of you guys who saw those clips uh, with the pike push-ups, I was doing it because in the previous clip, you see that I was failing trying to do the wall pike push-up. I wasn't trying to do a handstand push-up. I was just so burnt out, my delts were burnt out, so I did a substitute. Man, you guys ever work out and f have a plate feel like it weighs 30 pounds? Jeez, my arms feel like they're about to explode. Now I really feel like scarfing down like a thousand calories right now. I really wish I had that whey protein. I think I'm going to place an order like next week. Oh, shit. Uh, shit. Damn. Yo, that workout effed me up, bruh. Yeah, I got to place an order next week. I really need my whey protein. After that workout, yo, I was craving that whey protein, man. Holy shit. And you know what? With these videos, I'm not going to end it. I'm not going to end it by saying, see y'all next time, we're done. I'm just going to, it's just going to end. Because I don't know when I'm going to end these videos, to be honest. This may be the last clip. Heck, later on, I may just feel like recording myself talking. I don't know. So, it's just going to end abruptly.